this doesn't look good for me. Okay, and we are here on an outpost. Those outposts, they have these little security consoles. Terminal here. We have this guy for so long. I don't know how so he has been in my ship for so long. So I'm just trading him in. So we got 50k. And let's head right in and find the market of this station. Uh, here they are. I'm gonna sell all my crap. So yeah, after selling everything, we have some money to play with, even though everything is very expensive. Let's buy more of these to help us. Is this the level 4? No, I want this one. This help us survive and kill things faster. We're gonna use those in the future, so let's buy everything they have in terms of podcatchers and all those chilled stuff. But well, the engines are really important, so I'm gonna buy a T3 engine. We also need a better hull, better shields, better weapon system, better in extension, a better power system. So at least that should get our ship to our level, right? Yeah, I don't think I forgot anything. And also our weapons are already level 9. So we have a level 9 ship and all that is much better than what we, are, we were running before. So let's me just check here the chips. What are their prices? 2 million, um, 2 million. So it seems like we need around 2 or 3 million. Oh, nice. I really want a ship with web weapon burst. Or my main ship i really like the annihilator yeah this one is like the ship i always use it's around 2 million okay but let's go back to mission running let's go back to the freelancers because i think now we can at least survive most of the, the missions we get so now after we ruined the lives of two little villages let's go do our mission um zt barton what is this we have to kill a pirate market, oh god. Let, let's quick save, you can quick save by pressing F6. Then let's launch. Let's level up to, we just leveled up here on Soldier. Let's get the agility for better experience perk. I wanna get the grenade, whoops. Just real quick, we wanna grab the grenade talent next here. So our objective here is to kill this pirate market. This is a pirate station. I don't know if we're gonna survive, but now we have rail guns. We have level nine um, gear, which so should be okay. Those guys are shooting me a lot with their little guns, so we need to destroy those stuff. Oh, they have a dock. They have a dock. Okay, we can be a bit overrun. I don't, I don't need to remember where is the their dock. They keep spawning more fighters. Let's take out their oxygen, and again. I'm really new to this project, so I'm not really sure what destroying the oxygen pumps do. One of the funniest things for me to do in this game is when you're high level, destroying those these stations are really funny. Oh, here it is. Okay. The guy yelling is so funny to me. Like, he's really, really mad. Okay, I need to disable my guns and run a little bit so they can cool down. Let's put power to weapons so they cool down faster. Where's the drone? Because it's gonna be annoying me. Hello, guy. It's not a drone, it's a fighter. I'm not sure if that's correct. Okay, let's kill him. Rail guns are really cool because they are really balanced weapons. They do a lot of damage both to hull and to shields. Okay, let's put a, let's get power to weapons right now and kill everything. This station seems a little weak. Doesn't see doesn't it seem a little weak? Like it can't even touch my shields. Uh, yeah, fighters. See how much better this railgun is from what we were doing before. Now we can actually do missions. It's a good idea to try out different weapons to see what you like. Some people like to run full Gatling guns. Some people like to run a mix of Gatling and Pulse. Some people really like burst weapons. Wow, did that thing just crap out a fighter? I've never seen that before. <laughs> the animation at least. What just happened? Did something explode and I level up at the same time? That looked cool. Oh, the station is already destroyed. Okay, I <laughs> didn't realize. Did the station die already? Yeah, I completed the mission, right? Did we level up? Let's see. Yes, so let's take this one. What this does is when you use drifting, when you press Alt, um, your enemies move 70% um, slower. 
so this is really good especially if you have some ships that can capitalize on that so yeah let's see what they dropped so they dropped a little loot maybe 40k worth of loot it's good to think about the taxes because the taxes are really costly i hope there's some way to avoid taxes in the future oh i'm talking about the game of course so i'm gonna move to the next mission what is it level five boss fight probably defend mission pilots okay i hope this goes well um where's the guilds here so we are almost on the level two i've just been harassed by the scout ships i'm sure they notified their crew to rob the cargo you ready i was reading the text and the first thing i did was bump my face into the, his ship <laughs> You hire someone to protect you and the first thing they yeah, do is hit gone. you with their vehicle and yeah, that's great. Anything happen to my containers. Sure, I'm looking at those juicy containers and thinking, well, I want them for myself. But let's kill those guys first. We can shoot, whoops, we can shoot them with our railguns which are really OP now. What you want to do is draw fire to you and don't, don't let them just kill the freighter. Just one more to go. Maybe we'll have another wave. Oh, let's use this skill here that I told you guys before. So I'm gonna press drift. And the guy's a little slower. So yeah, that was really easy to kill him. He wasn't flailing around. Okay, sir. I'm gonna be careful. Stabilize. Oh, he's saying that again. He's really serious about those cargos. I'm very busy, as you can see. I should be protecting you, but I really want to capture this guy. Oops, I pressed the warp. It's my podcatcher, man. Chill. Chill out. Oh, there's another bot here. Okay, nice. We're gonna make money here. Oh, this mission is really good. Those guys are purple level. So, are they T4? I didn't realize that you would. I would find... T4 people, they are level 5 T4 ships and I hope they drop better loot There's, that's so many crates I love this mission yeah that's a lot of crap so let's get out that and let's kill, whoa there's another wave thankfully the cargo ship is still hanging so let's kill those guys but this is really great. Wow, did I just take a missile to the face and do nothing to defend? Well, that's great. But as you guys can see, I'm level 9. I have a better shield, a much better shield and much better hull. So they really are having a hard time at killing me. That's why finding some way to make money, like if you like mining, do mining. Like jumping straight into difficult missions when just starting the game is not really a good idea. Okay, our mission is complete. Let's try and stabilize those pods before they leave how many how much room they have okay i have more room for more people that pod is really far away i don't think i'm gonna be able to catch it but this mission type is really profitable like i don't have enough space for all the people i'm gonna capture and doing this on later levels you're gonna make even more money so unfortunately i ran out of time to get the other pods they were too far away from me and they vanished Okay, so here we are at another outpost. I'm gonna deliver those guys. I think I made a little money from delivering them. So yeah, after selling everything, we have one million, our first million. I think we got maybe one T4 weapon. I don't know what else here it was so expensive that I got so much money out of that. But we have, oh, there's a T3 here. So we got one million. Let me see if there's any ships here. But I just checked the ship console here and a new ship is still 2 million, so yeah, we still need to make more money. Oh, here we are on the minor defense mission. Oh, there's a level 10 miner here. So we just have to guard him and we're gonna make some money. Okay, here's a drone. Oh, the new railguns are so good. And just like the previous mission, we need to focus here on everyone that's firing at the miners. So you can see I'm gonna switch targets here. Because I think this guy was firing at the miners a little bit. I'm gonna kill this guy. Oh yeah, I forgot. I need to, be, to buy a new torpedo launcher or missile launcher. 
Oh yeah, there's a pot here. Oh, it's spinning so much. We have to watch out because I think there's gonna be another wave. Yeah, I'm gonna get ready for more. Let me just capture this guy real quick. You guys do a little dying or do a little capturing. Everyone is here, the party's all there. That's gonna go after the drones. By the way, a little tip for this mission, if you notice, the drones are really focusing fire on the miners, while the fighters usually do like some little flying around, and the drones are really effective at killing miners, so you want to focus on them first. Okay, and we level up and kill everyone, and we did a good job, so let's capture one more pod. We were going for alertness. I'm just gonna wait this spot to come back and then we are gonna look at what we have to do. And in this mission there's an explorer's guild, so I'm gonna jump right there, grab the explorer's guild mission. Here we are at the explorer's guild, so we can just talk to this guy and ask him, Hey man, what do explorers do? We discover. Um, great, we can ask you, oh yeah, we have to do like a, an interview mission, just like on the other guilds. Oh, and by the way, we got r rank 2. But actually, before we can rank up, we have to do a mission, so we have to go back to the Freelancers Guild. And it's a good idea that if you find a guild station, to just land on them and get the interview mission. Even if you don't do it, you can keep it here. Um, just like I have the Bounty Hunters Guild mission, and now I have the Explorer Guild mission. I'm gonna do it right now, but uh, I already have it. I won't have to come here to take them. Um, let's go to Marma. And we are here on the Freelancers Guild. Due to our recent achievements, we have earned the right to move up by an additional rank. So yeah, we need to take a mission here. Let's try track that right away and set the route so we can go there to get our rank 2 and unlock. Um, if you guys don't remember or don't know, on rank 2 you get even more money, you pay less taxes from, to the Freelancers Guild, you have access to the Epic Freelancer Armory, and you get even better contracts, even better missions. Uh, I've seen here, I had a little look here, and there's a Fire Tree Railgun, so we're gonna take that. We are using level 9 Railguns, and this is a level 11 one, Fire Tree, it is great. And there's another Railgun here, I'm gonna pick up too. And here we are, on the interview mission for the rank 2. Let's kill those guys. Uh, we upgraded our ship. As you guys could see, let's go and kill those guys real quickly. Power 2 weapons. Um, we really could do with a better ship. Um, let's use Drift here. So everyone is slower than us right now. Let's fire. Wow, okay. Yes, this doesn't look good for me. Okay, he's dead. If there's another wave, oh god, that was a little intense. Oh, I forgot to give those guys up. Did we level up? Yes, we leveled up. So let's grab this perk here, which should make things a little easier. And then let's focus on damage or maybe, maybe, well, this doesn't really matter for you guys. Energy, no, let's gonna focus on a little more damage for now. Okay, so what do you guys thought about that? Like. That mission was a little too close, as, I, as you can see, my ship is almost <laughs> almost destroyed. And yeah, now we are rank 2, so we have access to better missions and so on. Let's see, what do we have here? I'm gonna grab some relatively easy missions and I'm gonna do a montage where I grind my way all the way up to rank 3 because you guys saw enough freelancer action for the whole series, I think.
happened. I had a bad dream. I dreamt that I kept getting killed by legendary level 29 enemies while I'm just a level 26 guy with a poorly equipped ship. Oh no. Well, this isn't the ending I expected for this video. <laughs> I really thought we would be able to get rank 3 before the end, but the final mission here is really difficult to do on this ship. I'm not sure I can do it really, but I'm not gonna give up. We'll try to make it work, and in order to make it work we're gonna need help from the Bounty Hunters Guild. Because through them we get access to the Epic Components Market and the Legendary Components Market. We have a contract here to we'll hunt a bounty so we can get access to the Bounty Hunting Board. So let's go bounty hunting and maybe we can find some good opponents in order to be able to defeat those pirates and finally get rank 3 in legendary weapons. Mm -hmm.